just went to have um, breakfast. Actually, we went for a little walk towards the beach first. Uh, I think it's Lara Beach, so we just went out there. It was one of the younger players' birthdays today, so yeah, they went and gave him a few presents, and he gave everyone like a handshake. Um, I met the head coach and the coach, so the head coach, he doesn't speak English, but the other guy, I think he's like the assistant coach, was translating for him. Um, yeah, they were both pretty, pretty chill. They've got a game today, actually, that I'm not going to be involved in, because I just got in late last night. So I'm going to go do a little run this morning. So I'm going to pick up some gear from uh, the kit room, get ready, and then head to do a little run from yesterday. Yeah, I'm, it's better that I just take it quite easy today. Maybe I can watch the game later and see kind of what the level's like as well, which would be good. And then we headed after that to breakfast. And yeah, it was pretty amazing, actually. There was just, it was a huge open buffet. You could eat like every kind of food that you could think of. It was just a huge range of everything. Yeah, so I think like the Turkish kind of food was top quality. Like, you know, you could get like the olives and the cheeses and the breads and things. So I just did that. You know, go pick up my kit and then go for a little run, I think. So, so just got back from the beach actually. This morning, the first training I did, we ran on the beach for just like a little bit, I think for about 30 minutes. Then we did like a bit of footwork, just like, yeah, quick feet on the sand. We had some balls there, so then we ended up doing some like touches in a square with the other players. They were just throwing the balls in. We would change like 30 seconds each. We did a couple of runs, just short like shuttle kind of runs, nothing too heavy, just like 60%. And then afterwards we went into the sea. So that's the first time I've been to the beach for a long time and I went into the water clothes off in straight and yeah it was beautiful you know I'm gonna try and get some videos of that because like the 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 fitness lady she took some videos of us in the water so I'm gonna try and get a copy of that maybe and we'll see what happens obviously I don't really want to take my phone out too much videoing because yeah I'm on trial here so I don't want to like yeah in interrupt or like yeah make any problems with that I don't know how they feel with the camera personally yet so I'm gonna keep that just a little bit D-low. I'll talk you through, guys, what I'm doing. I'm just about to get ready, and they've got a game this afternoon, so I'm gonna go watch that. Good opportunity to see the level, and should be a cool experience anyway. They're playing a team from, uh, from Poland, I believe, so pretty interesting, should be interesting. Just got back from the game to my room now. A few thoughts after watching the game. They played against a second tier team in Poland. Um, and I feel quite confident after watching that game, to be honest. It was pretty decent quality. Nothing that I haven't seen before, that's for sure. And um, yeah, just excited to start start tomorrow uh, training I think we're gonna do a normal training and then Saturday they have a game so I think I'll be involved in that so gonna get ready for that uh, we have dinner soon uh, and just gonna sleep because like I said I still need to recover really from yesterday's travel so I'm just gonna do that get ready and prepare for that game on Saturday it's gonna be huge guys just go to my room now I'm gonna head to bed I'm really tired so just gonna get ready for the training tomorrow uh, I had a good buffet dinner tonight just had a lot of big plate of vegetables really had a little bit of buck love afterwards as well which was great so just signing out peace love ciao good morning just got up <laughs> about eight o'clock in the morning here 
Uh, we have to be at breakfast at 8.30 and I have to be at the medical room at 10 past 8, so I don't know what the plan is today, but I think we have training. Um, I'll keep in touch with you guys during the day and check out this view from my room. Not bad, not bad. So we just went to the um, like the where the doctor's room is. We got our weights done. We got like our blood pressure done, I believe. And he gave us like I don't know if you can see all these pills to take. Vitamins, I think. I don't know what it is to be honest. So we're gonna go do that. Head down to breakfast. Ten o'clock. I got to be at the gym, and then we're gonna go down to football training. So check in there. Beautiful morning. Just picked up my training clothes and yeah, I'm getting ready for the gym. So then we go straight from the gym to um, to the football field, I believe. So that's the plan for today. And then I think this afternoon we could be free. So I don't know, just chilling. I think we got a lunch, obviously, and then dinner later. But that's the plan for this morning anyway. Should be good. So we go. So, I just got back in my room now. Uh, my thoughts after the first training. Um, yeah, it was a pretty, to be honest, it was a pretty different experience than, of training than what I'm used to. It was, it was quite tough to kind of show yourself actually. Um, what we did was we started with like, uh, what did we do? We started with like a really like long warm-up, a lot of stretching. Then we went into like, yeah, this passing where you're like in positions. It's really hard to explain and I also didn't really get it that well. Uh, you have like three actions. So you're first playing a long pass through to the middle, long in the air. Then you're defending across and then you're playing, trying to play a diag out to some winger running through. So. It was a little bit tough to get, to be honest. Um, yeah, it is what it is. There's a language barrier, that's for sure. And that's what it's always gonna be like. I kind of had to expect that before I came here and just kind of deal with that. Um, I've been told that now we have to go and get the laundry in quickly so that they can wash the gear. Then we go eat lunch and then we have a second training today, which I was also unaware of, so. Yeah, just making the most of it and enjoying the experience. See what happens, you know. The level of football easily fit in the team, if not, you know, a little bit more quality. And yeah, just that 
there is a language barrier. That's it, you know, there's hardly, there's like, yeah, there's one person, maybe two in the team that speaks English and they're quite quiet people. So it does make it difficult to be honest. So it is what it is, just making the most of it and see what happens. You know, I can't really do much more than what I am. So I'm here and doing what I can. So just take it, taking a little rest. We're getting ready for the second training now. I gotta go meet the rest of the lads in the hotel lobby at four. And then we're going to training, I think at 4.30. So gonna wrap things up here, get my boots ready and then heading off to that second one of the day. Feeling good, feeling fresh. Yeah, hey guys, I just got back in from the second training today. Yeah, it was nothing too crazy to be honest with you. And yeah, if I'm honest about my performance, you know, it was nothing crazy, just yeah, nothing great, nothing bad, so we'll we'll see what happens. Um we have a game tomorrow against a Polish team, so I'm gonna go eat chill for the rest of tonight and yeah, get ready for that pretty much. So the light's going to be shocking here, I know that. I'm just sitting down on the beach actually. It's quite cold but, you know, it's just quite nice. It's like being back home for a bit. But anyway, I was just going to check in and tell you guys that I ate dinner. Uh, I'm just chilling out for the rest of tonight really. I'm going to maybe do a little bit of editing before I go to sleep. I got um, training tomorrow morning. Uh, we leave at 9.15, so I have to be up early and get ready for breakfast and go to training then. And then we have a game in the afternoon, so it'll be good to play a game again. It'll be quite interesting which position I'll be playing, see how the team kind of plays and the formations that they set up. So it should be quite cool to play a game again. So we'll see what happens. Of course, I'll let you guys know what happens after the game i'll see if i can maybe get some footage i don't know if i can yet of the game but um yeah no matter what i'll be in touch with you guys tomorrow so good night peace love ciao So that wraps up the vlog for the last couple days, just giving you guys a little bit of insight into what it's like here, the training, and yeah, what I'm up to. So yeah, like I said, the first day we had just a training on the beach, went and saw the, the team play that game, and then today I had a double session, so you know, it is different coming into a professional environment again now and, and getting back up to the level and the speed and the the quantity of, of training uh, so it's good to be back in the environment and you know I'm just enjoying every minute of it I had a relaxing time at the beach tonight just to yeah relax almost meditate a little bit and just be really appreciative of, of the opportunities and the chances that I've been given so far and you know just being very present and just really enjoying this experience here and like it's pretty amazing how how quickly things have moved and that yeah just how super i am how super lucky i am to be here so that's just wrapping up the vlog to tonight so good night peace and love and take it easy ciao